So today I'll be carving a pumpkin. I swear when I filmed this video I was on time, but things came up and now it's way too late and yeah, happy Halloween, except it's like over a week later. This is the pumpkin that we've chosen to carve. It's orange and it's pumpkin shaped and it was the only one we had, so it had to do. My mum is a lot better at pumpkin carving than I am. She'd already done a few at this point in Halloween and I haven't done one in a good few years now, so I needed some assistance. The fact that the chopping board kept shaking didn't help. And ta-da, its hat was removed. I then like stuck the knife in and cut away a bit more of the squishy bit so I can get in and remove its brain. Honestly, the smell of pumpkin is so nostalgic. Anyway, it was time for the gross bit, so I just stuck my hands right in there and started grabbing all the seeds, which I kind of just chucked on the floor. I, there was newspaper on the floor, but they kind of slid around and went everywhere, so that took a bit of cleaning up. Behold this beautiful hollow pumpkin. Buy it now for 2 99 and yeah, there was the majority of the mess. Nicely contained, mostly. I had a couple of ideas of what I wanted to draw on the pumpkin, and in the end I went for the panda because I only had one and I figured doing a frog was going to be a lot more difficult than drawing a panda. Of course, this was because of Mei-chan. Uh, why wouldn't I? So yes, this was the start of pumpkin Sam power. When it came to carving, I sort of regretted my choice to do something fairly complicated because literally all I've done before is like triangles um, and triangles. So I have a great repertoire of carving pumpkins. Um, so this was a little bit of a challenge, but honestly, I'm quite proud of myself. Like I know it's still pretty basic and it's pretty messy, but I didn't mess it up. So. That's a step in the right direction, and I'm going to take that and be proud of it. I was really worried I was going to mess up the eyes, because that little bit that I have to cut around, I haven't done anything like that before. All I've cut out before, when it comes to eyes, has been triangles. But somehow, I think it was a miracle, but I did it. So, I consider this a success. I scraped out a little bit for the mouth, so hopefully that would glow. Unfortunately, we couldn't find a single tea light, so we have a fake candle instead, but it does the job. Honestly, I'm so pleased with it. This is the best pumpkin I've ever carved, and a significant upgrade from the ones I've done before. I posted it on my Hello Project fan Twitter with the caption, Pumpkin Sand Power, and people seem to like it, and I hope that Mei-chan would like it. Also, it's very difficult balancing a pumpkin on your head. So, happy late Halloween, I guess. Um... Have a nice November.